I want you to picture this. How many of us have been in this situation? You're stuck in traffic along Interstate 4 like this, and you're wondering what's causing the slowdown in the first place. There's no crash, there's no disabled vehicle or construction. If you're like us, you have probably wondered what's causing these mystery traffic jams. Real-time traffic expert Jerry Hume finds out in this week's Extra on Getting There. Heading home for the holidays will mean Myesha Sr. will have to take I-4. And even during the pandemic, I-4 can cause headaches. I'm just stuck and then I get like, eventually it kind of clears up and you kind of see there's nothing, no, no reason for us to be in traffic for that long. These mystery traffic jams happen a lot for Myesha, stuck in big time delays with no real reason for the backups. The simple answer to why mystery traffic jams occur is, is you. The driver. Hatem Abu Siena teaches his UCF students in the civil engineering department. There are three ingredients for mystery traffic jams. First, drivers aren't going the appropriate speed. Second, they aren't keeping a safe distance from the vehicle in front of them. And finally, the road is at or near capacity. When this happens, the slightest disturbance in the road caused by you or another driver hitting the brakes. Uh, probably because they, they found themselves getting too close to the vehicle in front of them or another vehicle decided to change lanes suddenly. So that will allow the vehicle behind you to hit the brakes hard and the vehicles behind it to hit the brakes, causing like a chain reaction of brake lights. Something as simple as hitting your brakes can cause a shockwave through traffic. The car behind you may quickly be able to accelerate again, but it'll take time for the vehicle behind them and the vehicle behind them. If we can get the achieve harmony in speeds and prevent those like sudden acceleration or deceleration or braking, then we can smooth out traffic, especially like in, in the heaviest time at capacity and we can prevent those missed traffic jams. A team says Because autonomous the, or connected vehicles could be the solution. Until then, he recommends good. drivers maintain a constant speed and distance from the vehicle in front of them. Aisha Sr. isn't so sure that's possible. There's people who drive like 40 miles per hour on I-4. There's people who drive, I don't know, like 95 miles. So there's like, I don't know, there's no consistency there. But maybe if everyone could get the memo. A memo that could save you time in traffic. For extra on getting there, Jerry Hume, Spectrum News 13. Interstates like I-4 have introduced changing speed limit signs to try to help avoid those mystery traffic jams.